Hi, I'm Mr. Dickerson. You may remember me from such classes as physics, if you ever showed up. It took a lot of hard work to get where you are. You had to show up every day. Well, most of you. It's been a long go, especially the last two months. I've been thinking about what to say. I've been thinking about this moment, this video, for quite a while. And the only thing that I realize for sure is that there is no way for me to articulate what you guys mean to me. Okay, once you are my student, like I've told you before, you are always my student. And never forget that even though you have left my classroom, that you will always be welcome back in it. Today you're gonna open a new chapter in your life. Your dreams have finally come true. For some of you, it's a miracle, but we're proud of you nonetheless. Even though graduation is going to look a little different in these unusual times, the achievement is still the same. It, you're gonna be one of the few classes in history, one of the few classes in history that we'll be able to talk about something or your graduation, no matter how it ends up, that nobody else has ever had. I still remember as freshmen how short the boys were. The steps that you've taken, whether you were in basketball, gymnastics, another sport, um, drama, anything you've been a part of, all those things are going to be the memories you make for the rest of your life. What I like to write in your yearbook is to always take God into your plans for what you want to do in the future. God has a special plan for each of you for your lives. So trust him and he will open and close doors. You may have a trouble in the future sometime or other, but you can always go back to the Psalms. I think all of you are so unique and have the capabilities of being infinitely successful if you continue working hard and trusting in God. Never forget, God has a special plan for you. God works with us in, in different ways. Um, and we need to remember that he knew this was gonna happen and he knew it was gonna happen to your class. Jeremiah 29 11 says, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. I want to say this being my first year here, first three-fourths of a year actually here, that you guys really made my life a living. Hello? I think some of you guys survived nine of my classes by this point. I know that it wasn't exactly what you had in mind for your senior year, but um, it really has been a good four years, and I'm proud of you, I'm gonna miss you. My goal for you was for you to always feel safe and loved when you stepped inside our school, and I hope you can continue feeling that way as you prepare to move on. And just know that when you go through life, I hope that all of you are spiritually solid. Go out there and rock this world, seniors. You are a class that can move mountains. Hopefully we look to God as our supreme Father who loves us and wants the very best for us in everything that we do. He will never leave you or forsake you. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. I want to tell you also that I will have you in my prayers probably for the rest of my life. Please remember, uh, you are in my prayers always. God loves you, Chisholm Trail loves you, and you know I love you and I wish you the best, whether you go to college or you go begin your new career. You guys take care and know that this is gonna be one of the best years ever. And on behalf of the office, congratulations, senior class graduates of 2020. God bless. To the graduating class of 2020, to get to this point, it took four years. You went on 40 trips, you apparently managed to survive this entire time without the bus ever breaking down. I don't know how that happened. And who can ever forget that time? Oh, I laugh every time I think about it. That, well, I can't remember it right now, but man, was that funny. That was absolutely unforgettable. Then there was the time that all of you tried to become TikTok famous. Looking at you, Mertz, you really dropped the ball on that one. Remember all the good times we had on the Big Ben trip. That's what I like to remember about you. Beatrice bossing me around. You had to pass my English one, world history, religion one, religion three, world geography. What else am I forgetting? Dual credit religion. You had to pass my world geography class. Wait, not all of you had to do that. 
from all of us at Chase Central Academy. We wanted to say thank you for the memories. And no matter what you do or where you go, the Chisholm Trail will always lead you home. Unless you're going the other direction, in which case it takes you away. God bless and safe travels. We love you all. Safe travels. God bless. God bless. Safe travels. God bless. Safe travels. <laughs>